All right, what is up guys? I'm in a bit of a hurry and uh, you know, I'm just gonna not show you guys how to take this off. You can YouTube it. But if you're looking for a Jeep Compass or Patriot, it's the same um, 2007 to I think almost 15, 16, something like that. It's all the same. Um, same process taking this guy off. This is an Android radio install. It's gonna be a 10 inch, so it's gonna be a big boy, all the, all the space right here. And uh, yeah, we're gonna connect this. It's gonna be for my wife's car, Jeep Patriot 2012. Okay, so let's get to it. All right, so that was easier than I thought, so I guess I am gonna show you guys. So to remove this, you just wedge right here in the middle. Well, obviously with one of these guys. It actually came with new ones in the kit. Uh, wedge it in there, just pull it out. That's it, it's literally it. And then you got these screws right here to take off the radio and then it all comes apart. The only thing holding this guy, which you're gonna need to swap over your vents, all of that, swap over to your new radio place. I'll show you guys in a bit, but I'm gonna take this guy's off and then we'll continue to this part of the video. Oh, I wish it was less bright, but. All right guys, so I got a little ahead of myself. All right, it's not in there, even without clips. So I swapped out all these guys. Uh, there are one, two, three, four screws holding your climate control and one, two, three, four, five, six holding your things together. And you will need to swap over these clips, but it holds on really well without it. I just don't think it'll hold on in speed. Let's say you just yank, you know, crack VTEC in this Jeep and then it won't really run. So, um, I got a little ahead of myself. So everything is plug and play, like I said. So there's your connector there. And there's a bunch of extra connectors, which are all these down here. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Everything just plugs in place. Screen turns on, everything works. Got all these to hook up, um, which this one doesn't really need to hook up to. I can put a PS2 in here or something, or even a Wii. I'm not gonna do that, but you know, can. That's the key word is can. This is for your backup camera, the one that's lonely. It does come with a camera, just have no idea. Oh, there it is. So this is a camera kit that it came with 130 something dollars not bad at all so it comes with everything you need these guys work like they should you know ac you don't really like change the ac it's the same ac but it just looks so much nicer and so much more modern and watch where are the keys so if you guys got a jeep patriot or even a compass you guys can get this bad boy Look at that guy go. You can connect to your home Wi-Fi. That's the AC, I don't know why it does that. Um, let's load something, I guess. Okay, loaded last time, but I got the cheaper one. So look, it even shows you your device ports, what everything is on this stereo. That's a first for me. And that's obviously your power. So that's pretty nice that they do that. They got all your settings. This is Android 11. That's nice. Didn't think it was gonna be that new. Factory settings. Let's see my secret password. Does it work? No, it doesn't. Okay, so it's car settings, Android settings, volume settings, GPS detection, other settings. So this comes with a standalone GPS, Bluetooth, car settings, radio, and obviously your video apps. You can also download apps. That's what I love about Android radios is that it's so versatile that you can do whatever you want, man. Like anything. I don't know how well that works. Oh, no, no. That's creepy. Stop, 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 stop. That was creepy sounds. Um, so yeah, the stereo just comes off. You will not need, you will have four extra screws when you're done because you won't need those. Uh, it'll just clip back on. So I'm gonna install the backup camera. I'm not gonna bore you guys with that, but that is the install for this Jeep Patriot radio. If you guys have any questions, let me know down below. I can go more into detail or less into detail, whatever you guys want. But basically, like I said, this guy, yank off. Don't pull on, don't pull on these guys. It comes with, uh, comes with tools. I'll put the link down below to the one that I bought 
comes with these tools. I didn't use them because I have my own and I didn't see them, but you just kind of push up at the bottom. One pops off and then once you get like a little bit of leverage, just pull it off with your hands, go all the way around. Um, worst case scenario, this guy breaks and uh, you don't need it. So if it breaks, you don't need it. Then you just gotta take off all the screws, take off all these clips, and then you're good to go. Everything is plug and play, so you connect everything where it needs to go, where it's missing a spot, and then you're set. So these guys go in the white ports, and it only goes in one spot, so you can't mess that up. So that is it for the video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. We will get more Android radios. We will get more Android radios. All of the Android radios in every car. All of the Android radios. Keep following, guys. I'll catch you guys next time when I put an Android radio on that.